Oh, what's up, Josh? What's up, baby? How you doing? Man, sipping wine, feeling fine. Go. Oh, love it, love it. Can I ask you a question? Of course, I got an answer for you. All right, you're at the end of your life. Okay. You're an old man. Right. What do you want the world to know you for? Being the flyest that ever was. <laughs> nah, um, man, I just want people to say like, yo, Josh, he was passionate. He never gave up. And he loved his woman hard. He loved his family hard. He loved his art. And he loved people. Yeah, I'd say that. It's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing. Who inspires you? Me. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Um. Yeah, me. <laughs> and my dad. Yeah, for sure. Okay, okay. What inspires you? There we go. Mom, you inspire me too. Don't call me tomorrow. <laughs> um, dude, authentic people who are just authentically themselves. Um, for the longest, I've, I've struggled with that, and I finally got to this place where I figured out how to truly just be who I am, unapologetically. And uh, I love that, it inspires me so much. Uh, love, man. I love love. I love being in love. Uh, and I love seeing people's loves, especially older love, dude. It's just something about that sees in love, you know? Um, movies, art, food, good food. <sighs> but nature, man, nature the most. I could, dude, I could get lost amongst the mountains and rivers, dude. There's something about not feeling insignificant, but being small amongst these gigantic, beautiful, magnificent things that I nor you created, you know? It's mm. tight to me, bro. Mm. It's too cool. What kind of music and art do you want to make? Authentic art, man. I think I want to, I just want to continue to just make music that's just me, unapologetically me. I want to make stuff that's fun and funky. Um, I also want to make music that's for memories, not for moments. I think we live in a time where everything is so moments-based. Hmm. Trying to be viral, and this, this, and that. Um, there's just something about having a song that attaches itself to a memory that you can then play 75 years from now, or somebody else can. Uh, it's not about me, you know? Like, it's about the music. I'm gonna die one day, and if we do this right, the music will last forever, you know? Hmm. Yeah. It's a beautiful thing. Mm. Okay. So you're thir you're 31. Yep. No wife? Oof. No kids? Oof. Why are you still chasing this? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh no, friend. Because <laughs> I love it, man. Hmm. I would rather be... We'll go this way. I'd rather be broke and doing what I love than to be chasing money, making tons of money, and be miserable, and just working for something I don't really believe in, you know? Um, plus, to go back to your first thing, I want people to be able to, I want my, I'm gonna have a wife one day, I'm gonna have kids, and I want them to be able to be like, yo, dad didn't give up, Josh didn't give up, and he made it happen. And that to me is just so much more important than just doing something for the sake of money. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. So, yeah. Hmm. I think, yeah, for sure. That's it for me. So what is next for St. Rene? <laughs> <laughs> you gonna see.